Okay, finished uh, sealing and base coating my rally wheels. Uh, booth is running here. Just turn it off here. So here's what they look like at this stage. Sealed and uh, base coat applied. So again, using the uh, Montana Big Sky clear coat over top of the base. Uh, I'm really, really liking this uh, Montana clear. It uh, fairly easy to spray, and it uh, leaves a real nice shine. Uh, if any of you have been following prior videos, some bike parts that I did, I still have the tank here. But uh, yeah, this is this is what the tank looks like. So that's just out of the booth. There's no sanding or polishing being done on this. But uh, the sad part is. <laughs> shouldn't say sad part but uh, this tank is getting a decal kit it's gonna say Honda and stuff so I'll be wet sanding this down and applying the decals and then re clear coating over the decals so I'll I'll do a video on that I I think anyways if anybody's watching the videos if you you like or don't like or you want to see something specific or have suggestions for me uh, besides my uh, my lack of my camera skills but uh, yeah let let me know um, uh, maybe I can maybe I can try something totally different anyways I'll mix this up and then uh, yeah spray some clear on the wheels
So just after one coat of clear, it's really bringing that color to life. Um, I'll just let that set up for a bit. Then uh, I'll put one more coat. And uh, yeah, two coats of clear will be, be more than enough for those wheels. So yeah, in the first uh, video where I was sealing and basing these, I'm um, just talking about uh, spraying something wet on wet. It just refers to what it is, wet on wet. You know, you have something bare steel or uh, you have an area that you, you know, you've sanded, you've prepped, it's ready, but you're, you know, you don't want to prime it and re-sand it again. So that's where the term wet on wet, you, you seal it, you let it flash off, set up, then you put your... If it was a single stage, then you would just single stage, or if you're base clearing, then you apply your base coat, let that set up, and then uh, clear coat. So basically it's just a, it saves a step from sanding in between. Now, obviously that's something that you're not gonna wanna do on on uh, everything for most, most stuff, especially this, you know, obviously panels on a car or something uh, where you're doing body work and you obviously want to prime those and block them out and make them nice um, but uh, yeah that was just the the basics wheels door jams stuff like that basically areas that are not really fun to sand in the first place um, those are the areas that I I don't mind spraying wet on wet so to speak. But, uh, anyways, yeah, I'll uh, I'll let that set up. I'll spray one more uh, coat of clear, and then uh, that'll be it. Let it uh, let it set up for another five or ten minutes to, uh, we'll, uh, one more coat and that'll be it we'll shut her down for for that but, uh, anyways uh, thanks for watching and uh, maybe I'll have uh, more more videos to come I gotta I gotta think of stuff to do <laughs> so any uh, any ideas or comments or you know, you always see the other videos, like, subscribe, whatever. Give me ideas on what you may or may not want to see to, until the next time. Thanks for watching.